U.S. President Joe Biden has touched down in Northern Ireland, where he was greeted by Britain's Rishi Sunak on the tarmac late Tuesday. The president is there to mark 25 years since the Good Friday Agreement, a peace deal that largely ended decades of bloodshed, and to celebrate his Irish roots, a heritage he's fiercely proud of. Biden told reporters on Air Force One his top priority was to quote keep the peace and support recent post-Brexit trade deals that allow Northern Ireland to fully access the EU's single market and customs union. But a shadow was cast over the occasion. A protest from Northern Ireland's pro-British unionists threatens to unravel the province's mandatory power-sharing government, a key part of the agreement. For a year now, the Democratic Unionist Party has boycotted the National Assembly and other institutions in anger at post-Brexit trade rules which treat Northern Ireland differently to the rest of the UK. Biden is expected to meet officials from the five main Northern Irish parties on Wednesday. He may float the possibility of closer investment ties between the US and Northern Ireland to encourage an end to the impasse. Security concerns were also raised on Tuesday by the discovery of four pipe bombs in Londonderry, a city 70 miles from where Biden is staying. Police in a statement linked the explosive devices to Irish nationalist rioters who attacked police there on Monday.